All right, everyone, what's going on? And welcome back to the channel. So we have ourselves today, the fourth collection event of season 16. Uh, Apex has been dropping these events like hotcakes, bro. It's kind of crazy how many we've gotten this season. It's probably the most we've ever received in a single season, but it's the Veil collection event. We're gonna be opening all 24 event packs today and uh, taking a look at all the cosmetics and unlocking the caustic prestige skin, which honestly looks pretty cool. All right, so without further ado, let's try to burn through this quick because there's honestly a lot of packs and uh, yeah, let's, let's get straight into this. As always, you do save about 800 Apex coins if you do buy the bundles in the store. So we're gonna get seven with this uh, Rampart skin and three with this Gibraltar skin. So in total, that's uh, 12 packs, pretty much half of the event here for a little bit of a discount. We have the Rampy skin here, which is pretty nice. It's the Soiree Away. Honestly, Rampart's, uh, one of Rampart's nicer skins. I do like the arms. The arms look really nice and the eyepiece is pretty cool. Uh, I don't think it's my favorite one though. Uh, there is one that kind of looks like a Power Ranger with a visor and that looks really cool. But overall, I'll give this a, I'll give this a solid 6.5 out of 10. I do like to rate the skin. So we'll rate them out of uh, 10 for all the skins today. We'll buy this bundle here. A little 6.5 on the Rampy, bro. Don't mean to upset any Rampart mains in here. And we got Gibraltar skin here, which is the Court Executioner. Um, oh, I'm not gonna lie. I don't mind. I don't mind the skin. Not particular. Not particularly. If that's how you say. Uh, the biggest fan of the skin. Uh, the helmet. A little bit weird. Kind of a weird helmet. It's. I think it's the. The outfit for me, it's just, it's not hitting for some reason. And his face kind of looks like death. He looks zooted in the eyes and he kind of looks really tired. Um, I'm gonna give that a five. That's a that's a solid five out of 10 for me right there on the court executioner. Uh, so we got the 12, <laughs> we got this, bro, he looks zooted out of his mind in that skin, bro. His eyes are bloodshot red. Okay, we're gonna purchase the remaining 12 packs here. Uh, we'll get this for 7,000 and then we should be able to buy two more for another 700 right there. I have to do like, I have to pull up my calculator and like do all the math on this before um, I actually like do this. Okay, so we got the 22 packs. Let's start off pack number one. Here we go. <clears throat> Starting it off with an epic. See, this, this is the Rampart skin that I have on right now. This is my favorite one. That is a really, really cool pose though. The Scorpion Sting. That, I mean, I don't really know. I don't know what I do. If I turned a corner and I saw a Rampart just hitting a Scorpion Sting in my face, I I, I don't think I could shoot her. I just have to respect it. Be like, it's, it's pretty sick. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, it's my favorite Rampart skin. Pretty cool pose. Not pose, uh, emote. Pack number two, we got another epic here with a legendary. Caustic finisher, okay. Well, this is gonna be nice. I mean, the caustic skin comes with the finisher, but it's cool to get some more of caustic's cosmetics. We got Gibraltar. Uh, this is definitely the better Gibraltar skin from the last event. It looks much better than the one they just released in this event. Kind of a, you know, a Ronin theme. Um, pretty cool, pretty cool little emote though. You got the tropical tune hitting the ukulele as per usual. I'm sure it plays music in game. Pack number three, legendary, noise. We got a caustic emote, interesting. This is actually nice. Eau de Nox, I think, I don't know. I tried to make it French. Pulls off his canister, walks around with it. Light, let, let's it rip, bro. Let's it rip, bro. Caustic high on the gas, bro. I do feel like in the event packs lately, they've been a little bit more generous with like the cosmetics they give you alongside the event item. Like, look at that. We got a legendary Ash Banner. That's just, that's not even from the event, but I'll take it. We got a Wraith skin. I feel like it's been a while since Wraith has gotten a skin. Even if it hasn't been like, oh no, what am I saying? She literally just got one in the last event. Um, but kind of nice. She got the little masquerade on on here. Doesn't compare to the legendary Ronin Shinobi skin, like samurai skin she got in the last event, but it's pretty cool. Um, what is it called again? The Unseen Void. Uh, I'll give this. I mean, for an epic tier skin, it's honestly got a fair bit of detail. I'll give it. I'll give. I'll give it a six. I'll give it a six out of ten. The white hair is kind of cool too. 
All right, next up, we got ourselves a Valk skin. Okay, a little epic here. This, see, I love it when they make skins with this theme. They did it with Ash once, they've done it with Wraith, and now Valk has it. It's like a white and gold marble theme. I think it just looks super classy and like aesthetic. It's just really pretty. Valk looks good in this, man. I'll give this, I'll give the for an, for an epic, I'll give this an eight. I, I'm a fan of the aesthetic. I like this. And then we got a little wraith, hollow spray. You guys use hollow sprays? I don't know. I feel like I never even use them. The only ones I see people throw around are like little pred, pred little hollow sprays, but I don't use any of the legend ones. You got a new car. Oh, wow. Okay. Gonna have to check. Does this have pay to win irons? It has the little knob here. So already it, it has a little notch against it. Um, aesthetically though, it's it's pretty. The gold, the purple kind of kills it for me. I don't know why. I think gold and purple looks a little tacky together. It's kind of giving me like quest for booty vibes, you know, like a little pirate theme. Um I give this, I get this a seven. A seven. It's not. I feel like the score is only gonna go down over time though. Yeah, I'll, I'll give it a seven, bro. The brigantine's pretty good right now that I got on already. Next pack. Hmm. Got an epic. Pathfinder skin. Okay, this one actually looked pretty good in the trailer. It's kind of flashy. The gold and pink looks kind of clean together. I don't mind this. The deco droid. I'll give this. Once again, I kind of give. I'll give this a seven. Honestly, it doesn't stand out to me, but it's not exactly ugly by any means. It's it's honestly kind of pretty with the the pink and stuff like that. I like it. I give it a seven. So far, the skins in this event, not, not, not coming off too strong. We got two legendaries. They heard what I just said, trying to make up for it. We got a legendary octane uh, emote out of the park. He pulls off his leg and then what does he do? Smack a stim. That's pretty cool. That's pretty dope. I mean, I don't know, man. Emotes, emotes. I, I, I could pass on emotes. I'm all about the skins. I feel like you don't really care about emotes unless you main. Oh. Hmm. Like I was saying, all I care about is emotes because I mean, even if I don't main them. Loba. Loba. Can we meet it? We're gonna watch it. Pause. We're gonna need a pause one more time. I, I might make this. This is gonna. This is gonna equate to half of the goddamn video. Holy smokes! I'll I'll let you lead, Loba. I get, bro. This is okay. I'm coming off a little too strong right now. I like this pose. I mean, emote a lot. 10 out of 10. That's a 10 out of 10. This might be one of the best events we've had all season. Two legendaries! We see! Yo, Watson. Okay. Oh, wait. Hold up. We got a nice little Ashima. That looks pretty cool. With the sword and everything. It looks pretty dope with their new skin. Then we got the new Watson skin. Watson going crazy in this skin. The solar static. I like how as, as I take a shot at the event, they just hit me with some bangers now. Like, holy, we got the, we got the Solar Static Legendary Watson skin. The all black and gold theme is so clean. The little face mask thing she got going on, like covering the outline of her face. Super cool. I like the little headpiece. It looks cool. And the red too. The red kind of like, it just gives it some heat. You know what I'm saying? I, I'll give this a solid nine. This is clean. This is very, very clean. I don't think it's my favorite Watson skin ever made, but I do like it a lot. Big fan. That Loba pose, bro. I'm not even like assing it up. That Loba pose is, it, it's, it's different. It's quite uh, unlike anything else we've seen before. Um, we got, <laughs> we got a sear frame. Uh, smell the roses. Honestly, it's a pretty wide frame. It looks kind of nice. I like that. I like that a lot. Uh, pack number 11. 
I'm a little hot and bothered right now, bro. It's am I am I am I doing too much right now? I, I, I don't think I am. It's just it's, I'm just I'm just speaking my mind right now. We got oh look at this. We got Octane and his dad, the Silver Study, the little uh the frames and stuff on on the walls and stuff like that. Is I think yeah, this is Octane skin. That's honestly pretty cool. I like that. Got his dad on the back there. And then we got a legendary race skin. They just had a recolor for this skin in the shop like last week and I missed it because I didn't have this, but hey, I'm sure it'll come back. Uh, all right, pack number 10, I think. Another legendary, lots and lots of legendaries. I will take it. This is my favorite Watson skin, only because I like Naruto and it's Naruto inspired. Very cool. Wow, that is a really cool emote, honestly. She levitates with some rocks. And she got like the lightning around her. That would look insane in game. And she zaps everything. That looks really nice. Really nice. Pack number nine. Okay, we're, we're, we're getting there. We're getting there. You know, it's narrowing down. Sentinel. Okay, this is. Now, this Sentinel is truly like beautiful. It is a work of art. It is a little on the chonkier side for a Sentinel. I don't know if you see the back there. You see how wide that is? It's pretty wide. But the iron sights we'll definitely have to take a look at in game, see if they're pay to win. Um, they look pretty good from the trailer when we saw the iron sights in there. And it doesn't have any of the knobs on the side. So pretty, pretty clean for irons uh, as far as we can see so far. So we'll put that on. We'll check it out after. Um, pack number eight. It's definitely picked up in the second half of this pack opening. It, it's starting to, starting to hit us a little bit more, a bit more spice. Okay, the octane skin. The fiendish uh, filigree. Um, not a bad skin. Honestly, Octane it just has some really, really good skins. And that's what makes it so hard to like, you know, justify this one. I don't mind it. It's not my favorite color. Uh, I'm the gold is clean, the purple. Like I said, it's kind of like that, uh, that earlier skin. I just gold and purple with on the car. It just doesn't hit for me. So I'm probably going to give this like a six, six out of 10 for me. But I mean, if you don't have a good octane skin, I'm sure this will this will do good for you. I like the tats on his arm and stuff with the skulls and stuff like that. Moving on. Next up, we got an epic. Probably gonna be like another emote. Did Octane get two emotes in this one event? Cause you got yeah, you got the stim where he, he, he baseball bats the stim, and then we get the Maraca Madness. This is actually kind of clean. I'm not gonna lie. He's doing a whole lot here. Look at, well, hold up. He's competing with Loba right now. Woo! The spicy leg Octane, okay. Sheesh, bro, look at this. Oh, he's, he's rocking them hips, bro. <laughs> okay, Octane, I'm not gonna, I'll give that, uh, for an emo, I'll give that, I'll give that a nine. I, I don't think, I don't think he, I was mesmerized by that Loba emo. That was different. That was, that was pretty damn good though, Octane. Legendary. <clears throat> Get ourselves an Ash emote. She just, we just got an emote for Ash. And it kind of looked like this. But this one, she's doing a little one arm action and then slashes the floor. It was honestly pretty, honestly pretty cool. If you do that on top of someone's death box, you kind of like flaunt it and then you stab the death box. That could be pretty neat. I'll give that, I'll give that a seven. I'll give it a seven. We're down to our last handful of packs here. Um, we got ourselves an epic frame for Gibraltar. Did not like that Gibraltar skin whatsoever. I think I gave it a five, if I'm pretty sure. Um, decent, decent uh, frame, honestly. The frame itself looks kind of nice. People just like frames, you know. If you, if you mean that legend, it's nice to like have a variety you can put on your banner to customize. Next up, we got Loba. Ooh, Loba in her new outfit. The ha the haughty disguise. Haughty disguise. Okay. Oh, this is interesting, actually. With the swimsuit skin that we got, she had like these leg wraps that went up her legs here. And it's kind of like aesthetically trying to do the same thing, kind of. Um, she in the heels and it's got like the engravings on the pants, which kind of look like it. But overall, I mean, it's, a, it's an all right Loba skin. It's not doing anything special whatsoever. Um, kind of looks like some of her other more forgettable epics and stuff like that. So I'll give this, I'll give this a six. I'll give, I'll give it a six. Honestly, not even. I'll give it a five, bro. It's pretty, it's pretty bland. Um, yeah. 
Five. Moving on. That was a legendary. Legendary. Got a fuse pose. Okay, that's kind of neat. Like that. And then we got a legendary Spitfire. The belly of the ball. Okay. This is matching the Rampart skin that we got at the beginning of the event of the shop. Very nice. I do wonder if it'll have good iron sights. I don't think they're already just looking at it. I don't know if they're as good as the, the one I currently have on right now because these bars right here, they are a little narrower, but the optic itself that you look through is an interesting shape. It's actually a different shape than what is on the standard Spitfire circle. So it could give you a bit more visual clarity out of it. So we'll have to go and check that out. But aesthetically, I do like it. I mean, I'll give that an eight. It's, it's a pretty, pretty Spitfire. Um, we'll put that on, we'll check it out. Moving on. Moving on, monsieur. Got an epic. We have ourselves a brand new banner frame for Rampart. Very pretty. I do like it. Rampart always gets very elegant stuff. Um, really, really pretty uh, aesthetics and stuff like that. A little sun in the background, with the birds flying, I like it. And then last up, I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure it's the R99 we haven't gotten yet. Cause I, we, I remember seeing it as I like, and yeah, it's the R99, okay. This is a really nice nine. It doesn't have the pay to win iron sights. Like right there, it, it kind of like notches. I don't know if that's standard on all R9s. Is it normally like a full circle here? Or this one doesn't connect exactly. So uh, it's very thin though. It looks super, I love the color scheme, man. It's so pretty. It kind of reminds me of the prime bundle from Valorant. Um, I'll, it's worth checking out. I just want to see what it looks like because it's, it's aesthetic. But with that being said, that is going to do it for the event. We have one pack left. Let's open it up. The Caustic Prestige, baby. Let me see it. Let me see it, baby. I'm not gonna lie, this, of all the prestige skins, this is probably one of the cleanest ones, if not the cleanest we've gotten yet. I do like race a lot, but this is just, this is so sick, bro. We got, wow, bro, okay. So we got tier one, tier two, tier, tier three. No matter how cool it is, I still find it extremely difficult to justify spending 160 bucks on a single skin. Even with the finisher, it's just like, oh, I, am I gonna recommend this? I don't know, like, if you main caustic and you have a little bit of money to spend, I could justify it if you don't mind spending money in game. But we're gonna do, we're just gonna rate the skin for what it is and not based on the price, okay? Cause I mean, at the end of the day, it's just whether or not you like it. We got tier one, which is the Apex Contagion. And uh, he's got the man bun. He's got the man bun. He's got the face tats. Candy Roo's probably going crazy with the skin. He, I already know he was excited the day they, they revealed the trailer. The tattoos on the forehead and like the face look so sick. He's got the snake down the forehead, the green eye. Like I almost like the tier one variant just because of this, like his hair and his, his face and the tattoos more than the other variants. But uh, we'll put this on uh, tier two. We have ourselves the, um, is this also called Apex Contagion? Oh, I, I guess it's just all the Apex Contagion tier two. He's got the mask here, which is digitized. And, uh, you know, some of the cans are starting to glow. He's got the back piece there. And you can still see a little bit of his hair, which is kind of neat. Uh, it still sticks out the back. And then tier three is when it just fully consumes. It covers the hair. I wish they I wish they left the hair. The hair is kind of like a unique piece. It adds to it. But you get the canister in the middle here. And it starts glowing. It starts glowing over here. He gets the horns on the helmet as well. Uh, tier three, you need to use it to use the finisher as well. And he's got the little talons on the toes, which is pretty cool. But oh, actually, all of them have it uh, after tier two. But that's the caustic prestige skin. So let me know if you guys are excited for that. We'll go in the range now. We'll uh, pop a couple of modes, take a look at tier one in game, and we'll wrap things up from there. All right, so I put on a handful of caustic emotes that we could check out here in game. I do have the heirloom, so you'll be able to like inspect it. This is what the hand skin of tier one looks like right now. He's got the gloves. Pretty, whoa, that is creepy. Okay, Caustic is just creepy, bro. I haven't, haven't used him in a while. Pops the canister out. You can get a different angle on the hand skin there. Once again, tier one is the most basic variant. He's got the fingerless gloves, which is kind of neat on the right hand, I think. And uh, I'll try to see if we, okay, we got the little, yeah, we got the little, little coffee cup here. All right. Well, I mean, once again, this is why it's hard to justify because 
at the end of the day, you don't really get to see the skin at all, which is why, you know, it's an, to put it on the same skill as an heirloom, which you get animations for in game and actually get to see all game. It's tough, but regardless, we'll hit a couple emotes here. We'll pop the new, the new emote we just got. I just really, he kind of has a sleeveless vibe going on. Oh, he looks badass, bro. He actually looks badass. That's nuts. Okay. Pop that one more time only because it was so cool. Kind of looks young. The tattoos go all on his arms and back as well. That is so clean. Okay, we'll pop a different one here. Take notes. Pops the trap here. Oh, snap. Oh, that is cool. He just looks so scary in this skin, bro. It's kind of wild. We'll pop a different one here. We'll go the knockout gas. <laughs> oh, like it just, it just adds to it, man. It adds to it. He, I, I feel like I'm getting the true caustic vibe when I'm using this skin. He's kind of like a, like a, I'm just getting Yakuza vibes, bro. He drinks his coffee here. I don't know how he's drinking it through the mask, but you know what? It's a video game. I'll let it slide. All right. But uh, yeah, that's, I mean, that's a good look at it. Um, we don't get a heirloom emote with this skin. You'd have to wait for a recolor. I think an heirloom, em that's honestly something they should incorporate with prestige kits. Now that I think about it, we just got an heirloom emote with race recolor, but since you don't actually get anything to see the skin with on an heirloom level, I feel like that would be a great addition to this. Heirloom skin comes with heirloom pose so you can see it in all of its heirloom glory. Um, that should just be a standard now, but that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what you guys think of the caustic skin down in the comments. Uh, thanks so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed it, uh, like is always appreciated. It really helps out the videos more than you know, helps to reach new people. And subscribe if you guys wanna see more. We got a brand new trailer for season 17 dropping tomorrow. It's gonna be extremely exciting. Uh, lots of new season 17 details coming up. So if you don't wanna miss those, uh, like I said, turn on notifications and all that, but I'll catch you guys in the next video. Good rest of your day. Keep up, stay up. Peace out.